You'll never guess how many mummies scientists just discovered. Archaeologists just discovered a maze of tombs in Egypt, and inside they found several mummies. It's at a site called Tuna El Gabel, and it's a famous archaeological site uh, to the west of the Nile River. The mummies date back to a time called the Ptolemaic Dynasty, which is about 2,000 years ago, and the rulers were all descended from this guy named Ptolemy Soter, and he was one of Alexander the Great's generals. The scientists found maybe 50, upwards of 50 mummies, and they were all different ages, men, women, and even and children. The mummies were found in various types of tombs. They were found in wooden or stone sarcophagi. Some of them were just lying on the floor of the maze of tombs, and some of them were in sort of like niches or alcoves. Um, so you, there would be maybe five mummies all lined up in the little little alcove of this maze. Another cool thing about this is the mummies were in really good condition. Um, some of them had still had this cool wrapping called a cartonnage. Um, on their feet that you could still see the colors. And what cartonnage is, is it's a mix of linen and papyri, which is a type of like a papery material. And then it was coated with plaster. So you mostly see this in Egypt's famous um, funerary masks, um, like King Tut. A bunch of ambassadors came to see the site uh, to see all these mummies that were discovered. And they told the Minister of Antiquities that they were really only used to seeing mummies in museums, you know, with, with glass in between them and the mummies. And so to be out there in the field seeing these mummies was a really amazing experience. And they, and they said being face to face with the mummies was really wonderful. So not only is this, this uh, discovery important, but uh, scientists hope to find more archeological treasures at Tuna El Gabel. Thank you.